Hi Leos, how are you? Welcome to Cosmic Energies by Kushbu. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing amazing. So this is your October month read. Okay. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, you are free to check out other videos as well. So let's dive into your October month read. Let's see what is your theme or what is your overall energy for the month of October. Leos overall energies for my dear Leo's for the month of October overall energies for my dear Leo's for the month of October so you are in a ten of wands and a four of swords energy so overall energy comes out as whatever responsibilities or newness or um, things that were no longer in your alignment you are now finally thinking of letting them go things that are burdening you emotional mental or even action ways uh, which are expected out of you but you are no longer obliged to do it or you think that this is not your work and i need to let this go because this is draining me these things are finally um, getting your attention you are reflecting upon it you're thinking how to let go and uh, not guilting yourself into sitting in the same position so some major decisions about certain responsibilities or certain actions in the past that were expected out of you you're getting out of that situation and this is such a beautiful thing there are certain uh, new beginnings also you're ending a torturous cycle in the past uh, that has been going for quite some time and you no longer feel aligned with that energy um, certain responsibilities of people extra responsibilities that were just put on you but there is no you know uh, energy exchange in terms of those responsibility energy exchange can be in terms of recognition money or appreciation nothing is given to you and you no longer feel that this um, responsibility or this action that i'm taking for the betterment of everyone is needed in my energy so you're letting it go and you're thinking deeply before doing it so that you don't feel um, guilty or you don't feel that you took a decision in haste so the entire month of october i see you in a mixed energy of um, taking actions and some of the energy reflects where you're going to deeply think leaves okay let's see what are your opportunities going to be like opportunities for my dear leaves opportunities for my dear leos okay opportunities of abundance opportunities that are going to stabilize you humble you uh, a lot of career opportunities can be seen um, can be about education that is related to career can be about expansion some of you oh, might get associated with an Aries uh, and a Capricorn. That is the energy that I'm getting. Um, females, especially of Leo, uh, Leo females are going to find themselves being much more humble in terms of their money. They are going to save, they are going to help uh, people um, by making donations or doing some humani humanitarian work is the energy that I'm getting out of the Queen of Pentacles. Other of you, others of you are going to find a lot of financial opportunities coming in. Um, can be related to a job change or a promotion. That is a beautiful energy. I also see some of you... Um, I don't know wanting to buy certain pets and you buy or rescue certain pets opportunities of a good rescue is also seen uh, i don't know for whom this message is but it was a very specific message that uh, rescue opportunities for uh, rabbits dogs and um, cats can be seen here okay let's see what are your obstacles going to be like 
in the month of October. Obstacles for my Leos in the month of October. Your pride is going to be your obstacle. Most of the things go into your head. Okay, Leos, I know you don't like listening to this, but please don't mind. This is your obstacle. Sometimes you can become very self-centered. Sometimes you are very much into your head. You see that people are following me. It means I might always be right. And then you don't want to listen to anyone else's advice. So, uh, lack of listening to other people, lack of consideration and your own pride are going to become or can become uh, your obstacle in your progress and opportunities coming towards you. So pay attention to how you think, how you are giving out the energy to people, how you manage well with uh, groups and how better you are with your own energy or um, likingness in terms of your opportunities. Being confident is good, but being overconfident sometimes can make your opportunities go away from you faster. Okay, let's see what is coming up in your love situation. Leo's love situation for the month of October. Partnerships, uh, buying of homes uh, can be seen. Nine of Pentacles is a very beautiful energy. Abundance uh, coming into relationships and love can be seen. Final, uh, finally, I also see slow growth. Like things have been slowly growing. But finally, the, uh, the sweetness of this relationship that you are in or wanted to seek in or were in but didn't know how to you know deal with it that sweetness is now coming into your relationship it is entering your relationship in such a beautiful manner you're also going to receive a major news from a loved one if you had been um, at a distance from this person haven't been having communication so major communication energy can be seen uh, coming in towards you. Um, I also see a message about a travel or a message of traveling towards you can be seen in this energy. Wow. That is a beautiful thing. Okay. Let's see what is your overall energy. Sorry. Overall guidance like. Let's see what is your overall guidance. Your overall guidance is the Hierophant. Uh, Leo's you being told that certain practices that you had been doing, you are not at all uh, sincere about it or you could not stick with your practices. If you had started certain practices of meditation or puja, mantra, uh, if you're doing any mantra job or chanting and you have not been doing that of late you have let go of it so you are being guided that in the month of october you need to be very strict with your schedule formulate plan and stick to it because the more um, evidently or the more confidently that you do your practices practice your spirituality practice your um, any new project that you have started, practices that help you keep uh, soulfully mindful, these practices need to be guided and these practices need proper attention in the month of October. So start giving it the proper attention that they require, start helping yourself by setting a certain rule, make a practice and stick to it and this will help you release this pride because it, once you practice meditation once you practice sadhana or your chantings they bring you in a proper energy so mental energy if it is elevated or highlighted it also gets uh, centered and it also balances out okay let's see a moon message as we have eclipse season coming in beautifully for you so let's see what is 
a moon message for my dear Leos. You being told Leos that you are good enough. If ever anyone any or any person or situation made you feel that you are not enough, you are falling short in your efforts, you are um, not giving in too much of your energy or you are being scolded for not being a good parent or a mother or a father or a sister, don't listen to them. You are doing everything you can. You are the best person they could get. And you are doing everything in your energy to give them what you want uh, or give them how much ever you have to give. Uh, so don't feel like you are not good enough. You are. You are good. You are doing everything in your capacity to provide to the other person. And you have the right to be a little selfish because being selfish doesn't mean that you're not good. It means that you're protecting your energies. Okay, so protecting your energies doesn't make you a bad person. It means you are considerate of your energies. Okay, let's see what is the energy. For my Leos, we are getting an angel message before we end this reading. So Leos, you're being told, if you keep your patience, do your practices, there is a peaceful resolution coming for you and your situation. So you need not worry about anything. Everything that you feel that is non-resolvable or cannot be resolved by you right now, if you think a situation is too tough and you're not finding a way out, even letting go your pride is not helping you. So don't worry. You're being told peaceful resolution will come through because your angels are going to help you with that. Okay. If you like this reading, please hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload the videos. Bye-bye.